Ask the Messengers, the program that deals with substance abuse, real people telling real stories. Hosted by Pastor Lester Lewis, co-host Charlize Wilkerson and Leroy Carey. Produced by David Humphreys. Where there is addiction, there is a chance for recovery. We're trying to help save lives on Ask the Messengers. Today on Ask the Messengers, we celebrate recovery. The 17th annual Celebrate Recovery Walk and Rally was held on September 9th on Belle Isle in Detroit. And the Ask the Messengers camera was there. Our street reporter LaShawn Battle talked with Lauren Stovall of the National Council on Alcoholism and Drug Dependency, Greater Detroit area, about the walk and rally. I work with one of the organizations that helped to put this whole event on, uh, the National Council of Alcoholism and Drug Dependency, the Greater Detroit area. Um, and so this event is put on by a very small committee um, of dedicated people, including myself, uh, within uh, Detroit and Wayne uh, County. Um, who have put, been putting this on for 17 years now. Um, today is the 17th year of this Celebrate Recovery Walk and Rally. And uh, it was created to do just that, to celebrate recovery. September is recognized as the month of recovery. And so we've historically been doing this uh, every September around this time. Um, we've been in Lansing and done it. We typically do uh, appreciate to do it right here uh, in Detroit at Belle Isle, um, just due to the great history here and the scenery here and um, the efficiency to get people here. And so uh, today the weather held out. It's beautiful. Uh, it's, it's hundreds of people here uh, with their families. Um, and it's a day of fellowship and fun uh, to celebrate. So this is people coming from all around? From all around. Um, you know, not just from the city of Detroit, but the surrounding areas with their families. Um, these are persons in recovery. Organizations are here, such as Salvation Army, such as Mariners Inn, such as SHARE, uh, such as the National Council of Alcohol uh, and Drug Dependency, um, Detroit Recovery Project, Detroit Rescue Missions Ministry. And so many organizations throughout the community are here. I am an advocate for people in long-term recovery, so I'm a preventionist. I go throughout the community um, and I facilitate groups to parents, to adults, to children, to youth um, about how to prevent substance abuse. The mission of this is to show um, that recovery can be celebrated uh, and that people can and do recover um, and to really get away from the stigma that's associated uh, with addiction um, and really to celebrate the gains um, that are happening um, with recovery and so it, today it's about a celebration and it's about bringing awareness uh, that people do recover and a lot of people are understanding that addiction is a disease um, and many people want to stop but again it's a disease um, that there is is help for uh, and so a lot of people in recovery, they are seeking help. Um, they're seeking treatment to, um, to treat this disease of addiction. Um, and, and so the stigma is that people don't recover. And well, we see hundreds of people here who are in long-term recovery. So if a person wanted to participate in this event, what do they need to do? Um, they would need to contact um, my, myself, NCADD, or our website, uh, michigancelebraterecovery.com.